It stopped. F***ing <laughs> Christ. Oh my god. It was just a nightmare. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Stalked. At one point in the story, you get to choose to call Liam back or not call him. I've tried both, and it leads to the same storyline. Uh, but that's all I'm, I'm going to say on what to expect. The story is, you've escaped from Liam's obsession. Kate seeks refuge in her grandpa's mansion. Strange occurrences raise questions about Liam's presence or another figure. Unraveling mysterious letters, Kate embarks on a journey seeking peace. So without further ado, let's get into it. I had to break up with Liam, and I hope he takes well. Ooh, that is very sensitive. Let's change the mouse. There we go. This is fancy, man. I need to make some food, I'm hungry. A reading nook. Yeah, sprint. All right, let's see what's in the fridge. Don't have any crouch. How come I couldn't grab that food? Hmm. Uh, I need the frying pan first. Thing's dirty. God damn. Doesn't look too bad. Who would be knocking on my door at this hour? I wonder who. Better answer the door with a knife. Who's there? Hey honey, can I come in? Ugh, Liam, I told you it's over, so no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You will be mine again soon. That's unsettling. Sounds like he walked away. Thank God. Yeah, he actually heard the footsteps. Yeah, it's still dark as hell out here. You can kind of see the street. It's weird that it's so dark. Probably close that. Is our food done? Great from the pan. A bath to calm myself down a bit would be great right now. Kind of tubby got here. Oh yeah, it's huge. Interact with any of this? No. What was that? Probably him. Wrong door. Give me another chance, please. I'll treat you well and do anything you want. I promise just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much at all. Or can it? <laughs> Throw a rock through the window. No, 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 I gotta leave before he does something worse. I can see better through the glass. Is 
It's so dark. Okay, nope, nope. They gave me goosebumps and I was expecting it. <laughs> Sunday, September 3rd. Grandpa. Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate. What's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. And now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he'll find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me for as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. That's fine. It's still going to be safer than staying here. Can I go there now? Yes, I'll send you the address. The key to my house is in a flower pot. Ooh, so that's changed. Also, remember to keep the doors locked, and if you need to go outside, you can always check the peephole first. Okay, thanks, Grandpa. You're a lifesaver. No problem. I hope it all goes well, and don't hesitate to call me again. I knew that was going to happen, too. Oh, drive, drive, drive! That's unsettling. That door should have been locked. Just saying. Last time in the demo, the key was in the basement, so it's in a flower pot now. That was a close call. Thank God I made it out. Lee won't be able to find me anymore now. I finally broken free from that toxic relationship. I mean, you live there still. You gonna move? Should probably move. Get a restraining order or something. Nice little drive in the woods. It's always creepy at night, but I'm a nature kind of guy. I wonder if did Liam manage to follow me here? Getting too paranoid now, of course it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. Grandpa needs to cut his grass. Press F to turn on your flashlight. Just doing a perimeter check. And then looks good. There's a side door. I just said the key was on a flower pot, right? Just wanted to make sure it was locked. You got the key? Turn the lights on. Oh, it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. Ooh, we can lock it. All right. Oh, I wonder what happens if we don't lock it. Eh, I think we know. I think we know. Not the best light, but it's light. Are there more? Let's turn on all the lights. We'll check that out in a minute. All right, nothing yet. Oh, it's the side door. Don't close that. Lock it. Got a broken mirror here, Grandpa. It's a nice tub, though. Eh, a little beat up, but it's big. 
any of these drawers. No, I can't really interact with anything. See what's in this room. Like, I'm expecting something already. Kind of like a storage room, I guess. Spare room. Is this the kitchen? Empty. Grandma's not eating much. We can't really go in anything. Let's head upstairs. I hope that was me. It's so dark in these rooms. Kind of broke, but no big deal. I love these types of couches. One day I'll have one. They're expensive. Actually, you know what? I don't want any surprises. I want to keep those lights on. Can't really see anything. All the lights on. Is this is this the bedroom we need? These rooms are huge. Let's see what else we got. I can't interact with any of this. Do we go to sleep now? Can we lock this. We can't. We know the front door and the side door are locked, so we should be good. Oh, well, it's much bright. Oh, yeah, it's daylight, I guess. Three feet. Wow, I slept that long. It's 4 p.m. No way. Jesus. Grandpa home already? I doubt it. He said he's gone for a week. Don't need the lights on. Actually, let's keep the hallway lights on. We're gonna keep lights on. It's before you know, it's gonna be dark soon, probably. She woke up at 4 p.m. Dearest new resident of this mansion, I'm the previous owner of this mansion, and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we will get along just fine. I will be watching you. That's not weird. Watching me? This is a strange to say the least. This is strange to say the least. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark though. Let's be careful. Make sure it's locked. A nice ride here. All right, off to the store we go. Yeah, see, it's already dusk. What's that? Some kind of paper? That's new. I don't remember that being in the demo. I never played the demo. I've only watched someone play it. One of my favorite YouTubers. Wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to me. I mean, it looks a lot like you. Right mouse button to switch sides. Ashley, missing since 8 15 2013. 
This is horrible. I hope they find her. Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. Just tab to look at shopping list. Collect items from the top to bottom. Alright. Automatic doors, I like that. It's fancy. Next. Soda pop. Where are you going? Which car are you getting into? Of course, it's the rape van. Oh, you're not even leaving. You are going to kidnap me. Just sitting there waiting. Need some milk. Some, some warm milk. Okay. Some cereal. And wine. I do enjoy some wine here and there. That's all. Let's go pay for this now. Hey, sure. H Hello. Is that all? Yes. All right. The total is twenty-two fifty. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you're new here. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. All right. Have a good day. Here are your groceries. Thank you. You too. That's a new. He was a little creepy last time. I remember that. I remember this dude comes like sprinting at us, talking weird. <sighs> that makes me unsettling, or that makes me uneasy. That's unsettling. You know, a young, beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out here all alone like this. What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best to remain unspoken. Be careful, and don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings. Resuck my space and stay away. Yeah, it's a little creepy. Let's not forget the groceries in the car. Yeah, a little snappy. I'm gonna be up all night because you slept all day. Alright, door's still locked, which is a good sign. Lock that. I'm glad I left some lights on. Oh, there we go. The essentials. <laughs> All right, that gave me chills. Son of a bitch. Oh, we gotta go in the basement now. Welcome home. Uh, you looked beautiful in the store today. Hmm. Can't wait to see you again. Is either the dude in the rape van or the Getting closer. Is he inside or outside? I'm soon there. Oh, I got goosebumps listening to that. Well, if I'm already there, is this side door locked still? Is that what he got keys? Or he used to be the owner. I'm here. Oh. God, are there two people? Mm-mm. Nope. 
I ain't opening the door. Check the door. I ain't opening it. There's no way. Oh, man. Is there people on this door? Oh, there should be a people on the side door. Someone's upstairs. I want to open the door. I'm like holding down the sprint button. <laughs> Dear and resident, congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. This is getting out of the pan. I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Is anyone in the car? No? Okay. The car gonna be dead? No, not now. Start, start. Please start, come on. Why not of all times? Something is really wrong. I I have to get inside and call the cops, like, right now. What do you mean? You have a cell phone. Hmm. Just call him right now. Press F to call the police. Press an F. Oh, here we go. Why would I go outside now? Uh, because there's somebody inside? 911, what's your emergency? Hi, I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Can you please provide your location? I'm at... Redacted. It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay in line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a safe space. So, try to find a safe and secure location within your home. This is all I can think of. This is all I can think of. Oh god. And make sure to lock the doors. The officers should be there soon. Lock the doors. I did. Didn't I? Oh, I didn't. But there's someone upstairs. I, dude, there has to be somebody upstairs. Mm, I locked the doors. Yes, they're locked. Please hurry. Help us on the way. Stay strong. I'm here with you until the officers arrive. Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. I want to turn the light off, but I'm scared. It appears... That everything is under control now. Our officers apprehended a man in a white van outside her residence. We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. What a relief. I never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things can get back to normal now. Nuh uh. Motherfucker's upstairs. It should be safe now. Let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Oh, God. We're gonna leave that one locked. I'm gonna use the side door for this one. I'm just expecting someone to be here. I 
should probably lock it, huh? Oh, man. Hmm. We grab this flashlight yet? This flashlight up. Someone's in the house. Like, I'm, I'm, you can't tell me otherwise. Power should be back on now. Go back inside. Grab, grab the flashlight. I stink of sweat. Let's take a bath before I go to sleep. Do a sweep of the house first. Grab a kitchen knife. Something. Hmm. Is this only bathroom? Nice soaking tub. Finally, a moment of peace. Why would that stranger go so far for me? Whatever, it's over now. No, it ain't. Oh, don't. What? I'm so exhausted that I'm hearing things now. Let's just go to bed. Oh, man. Excuse me. I don't want to go to bed. You just heard a camera. I'm going to leave all the lights on. Is there a light for the stairs? I don't like that there isn't. Oh, all the silly lights going on. 100%. God, I don't want to go upstairs. Grabbing. Uh, are there even knives in the house? Ugh. Come on. No one in that corner. Do we check all rooms? Room's clear. Oh, we're gonna have to sprint out the front door, aren't we? Mm, man. He's under the bed. Where else would he be? I'm so on edge. Going to sleep's a bad idea. Someone's going to be standing there. What is that noise? Someone beating it? Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. So is that downstairs? Yeah. I hate how dark this is. And yes, I will be sprinting 
everywhere in this game for the most part. It stopped. Fucking Christ. Oh my god. It was just a nightmare. I should probably call it. Check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I had just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me safe. Ah. Uh, no. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. I mean, you could call Liam. Then you gotta deal with this psycho ass again. Then you got two psychos, but one psycho's fighting the other psycho, so. You know? Plus the dream. I look like Liam. He's, someone can fit back here perfectly. Make sure that shuts. Check downstairs now. There's not like a secret door here. Something looks off about that book. Ooh, secret room. Or does someone place this here? Yo, called it. I knew there'd be a secret room somewhere. Do I go in? Do we check the rest of the house? Let's check the rest of the house. Alright. Clear! Still locked. Still locked. Let's take a peep. Still good. Alright, we got... We're clear to check it out. Shut this door. Oh, there's a lot of notes. I have to do a lot of reading. Damn. Let's start. Sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts unknown. 27-year-old Ashley was reported missing on August 15, 2013 by her husband two days after she disappeared from their home. Last seen in their residence, Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicion, suspicions, with her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in the search for Ashley, where she was last seen. This house. Is that the same chick from... That picture we found? Look, honey, we made the news. Pretty cool, right? 817. 817. Same day. I can't replace you, Ashley. There's no one that is that is as special as you. 818. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other options. 819. Okay, so those are kind of like right after another. A couple days later. <laughs> what the fuck did I do? How am I going to live without you? So you killed her. What is the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. Ooh, so this is... Oh, this is September. 9-4. Am I dreaming? I swear that it is you. She looks just like you. Wait, so 2013? Oh, so these are recent. It's 2023. Have you come have you come back to me ten years later? She's just as beautiful as you were. She has to become mine. She will no matter what. I can't let her run away from me. Like you once did. Fuck, we should have called Liam. <laughs> I kept her skull.
Why would you want to leave me? I have done nothing but... I have done nothing but be good to you. Whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again. Alright, so that's an older note. I... It's probably about time I talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. Yeah, and why is the light different? Is it dawn again? Or dusk? Not dawn. Grandpa, are you there? Yes, has something happened? A lot has been happening. I've received letters and been followed by someone I don't think it's Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things, to say the least. What? This is insane. Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters? In a hidden room? I've lived there for 10 years and never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP. I can't stand not being able to help you. I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? It makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person he bought this place from? That could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had currently gone missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name was... See, you sure to grab the flashlight. You still have your cell phone up. Are you serious? My phone ran out of battery. I didn't have time to bring the charger with me. Ah, did we go down? Let's go find a flashlight in case I need one later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. Yeah, you should have grabbed it before. I really want to go down there. Close that. Let's take a peep outside. It's still clear. Alright, alright. Is it still locked? If you, have, if you own the house, I mean, I'm, I'm sure the keys haven't been swapped. Alright. We're locking it every time. It is nice out here. Alright, it's pretty bright. I like it. Mother f I'm so flinchy and jumpy. I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. I told you to do that the first night you got here. Yeah, let's get the weapon before we go down. That sounded like it came from here. You got a pretty heavy duty looking flashlight and like a bash someone's face in. No, grab the key. Am I not supposed to grab a key? Alright, save that for later. There's nothing of use in here. Yeah, just some snacks. Oh god, what do I do? It has to be Grandpa, right? Nope. Just talk to him. He's gone for a week on a business trip. That means he's not close to home. Dude from the store. Hi, sorry if I scared you. I just had to come to clean about or come clean about something. Of course he did. 
You are the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. It all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again. And just like that, it's dark out. What would have happened if we chose to have Liam come back? So what do we do? Do we go in the creepy area now? Really? It's night already? Yeah, you have a terrible sleep schedule. What do you mean? Mmm. Okay, nobody in here. We're good. Nobody under the bed. Did that come from the bedroom door? Did it? Nobody's home. Oh, God. No, why? Thought this was over? You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this. And you don't know where I am. There's nothing that I can stop me anymore. What do I do? I know. If I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. You're gonna go run outside in the dark? Where? Where? Where was that from? Did we go out the side door? Let's try the side door. Nobody? Nobody? Good? We're good? Let's lock it? Not that it matters. Nobody out front. Just run. Run faster. Use that adrenaline. Oh god. Noises like that are worse than jump scares. This path? It's just a, just an animal, no big deal. Oh, does that lead to the house? Oh my god, take his car, take his car. This is definitely Liam's car. I'm gonna keep that open. How does Liam know about this little tunnel? This leads to the house, doesn't it? I mean, where else would it? I heard someone cough. blood now oh god which way do we go oh god Liam oh no that's Liam what happened to you why would someone do this she is mine and only mine Alright, let's keep press shift to sprint. Oh, I've been sprinting. Which way do I sprint? Out? I would leave. Was I supposed to sprint inward or out?
Is that my coffin? There's that door. Oh no. Oh no, it's her. It's Ashley. I think these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even know. Sorry, I just heard a noise. I don't even want to know what he would do to me. Oh, uh, he's gonna f***ing do the, the same. Okay, sure. Hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. So I... So it... It was you who has been sending the letters. I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. I look is more than enough. Come here. I've been waiting so long for this. N no, I have to run before it's too late. Don't even look back. Don't even look back. Should have grabbed Leem skis. Oh my god. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're almost there. Cops are outside. Yeah. About to shoot that mother. <laughs> the police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He had a sinking gut feeling that the worst was that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly and then made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man is in the white van said that his reason for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and, they, and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife, Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. 